John, the Drone Ranger of South Florida. Okay, this segment, I am going to answer a question that I have been asking uh, on Facebook and on searching for on YouTube and stuff like this, and I haven't really had any real luck trying to find an answer that was actually feasible or uh, <laughs> affordable. Uh, for those of us drone flyers who like to go out in the field who want a bigger screen. Now screen mirroring is a little bit difficult on the regular uh, RC controllers for the DJI drones. Uh, mainly because you have to have your uh, phone or tablet hooked up to it. But for the DJI RC Pro and the smart controller and the new smart con RC uh, controller for the Mini Pro, it has the capability of doing this. Now, I have searched on YouTube, and I didn't find a whole lot that was helpful um, trying to uh, find a solution to screen mirror. Now, what I want to do is I wanted to screen mirror, and I'll move back here. This is my 17-inch you know, computer screen, laptop. Now, what I wanted to do is to screen mirror my controller uh, which also is connected to the drone camera, whichever I'm using, the, uh, the uh, Air 2S or the Mavic 3 or what have you, uh, and have it on a bigger display screen so I could get a better idea of what's going on around me. Now, the recording would still be the same on the drone card. You won't have all the screen recording uh, uh, applications and data on there like you would on screen record. So anyway, I saw a couple of videos, and basically all I saw was uh, <laughs> uh, how to do it wirelessly, for one, uh, which isn't feasible in the field if you don't have a Wi-Fi connection uh, or a mobile hotspot. Even so, it's going to be a choppy picture. And the second was this really expensive stuff that you have to have all these little cables and this and that and the converter and blah 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 and whatever else it was. It was ridiculous. So, I found a way to do it for less than $40 to $50. That's right. So, I don't know what the heck my camera here is doing, but <laughs> it's putting all these displays up. But anyway, let me show you how to do this. Now, all you're going to need are three things. One, a regular US, uh, regular, sorry, HDMI cable. I prefer the braided type because it's much more flexible. Make sure it's rated for 4K because most of your drones now shoot in 4K. Second, the second thing you're going to need is you're going to need an HDMI, female HDMI, to a C port uh, USB adapter. Third, and the most important, a video capture card. Now, this one is not the expensive one. I have seen these on Amazon for like $140, you know, and some are very more expensive. Uh, <laughs> I got this little bugger for 20 bucks at Walmart. That's right, Walmart. So, what I'm going to do now is I'm turning on my drone. My Air 2S. Got that right here, just turned it on, and it's facing my backdrop. RC controller. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to plug everything up right here in front of everybody. Right here, USB-C, 
with the HDMI adapter right here. Plug in one end of your HDMI into that adapter right here like this. Okay. Now you see the screen display. Okay. Let me bring this closer so you can see it. All right, you see that. Last piece of the puzzle here. Video capture card, the $20 one. Now you can go ahead and spend 100, 150 bucks on one of these or more if you want to. I have found I don't need it. Just plug that in right in there like that. And what you do, plug it into the USB port of your computer. Okay, right now you don't see a whole lot, do you? No. Until you go, and you, this is one of the tricks that I found. You don't go to the screen mirroring options on your computer. All you have to do, if all you want to do is just get a better, bigger uh, uh, picture of your video, is go to the camera. You go to the camera icon on your computer. Now this is the regular. This is just shooting me. Okay, let me get this, that. So you can see, okay, this is just a regular shot of uh, your laptop cam. What you do is a little icon up, little icon right up here to flip the camera to a different display. You click that. There you go. Mirrored. You can move the camera around on the drone. See it? There you go. Mirroring the controller. And it is from the drone. As you can see. Hey, <laughs> look at that, there's me, all right, so, turning everything off, and when you turn everything off, you get this screen here, which is basically, you know, the color bar screen, so, just X out on that, and that is all there is to it. Um, why some of these drone groups, um, some of these guys on the drone groups, especially some of the professional guys, I'm part of 107, some of the commercial and other uh, professional drone flyers on some of the Facebook groups refuse to help. Uh, they give you all these convoluted answers and solutions which are ridiculous uh, on simple problems like this. Uh, as I find them, that I run into them and I find simple solutions for the everyday guy like me who is part 107. I do do a few jobs. I've got one coming up you'll see on YouTube here soon in the next few days. Uh, why they insist on <laughs> giving you all these complicated and convoluted suggestions on how to do the simplest things like this is beyond me. Uh, the drone community, I was under the impression they're tight-knit and they want to help each other. I have found out that's not the case. There are a lot of snide and elusive and just plain outright <laughs> jack wagons out there who don't want to help the guy who's just starting out uh, his own drone business or just do technical, little minor technical stuff like this. Because I guess they're afraid maybe if they're going to get their business stolen, even though they're <laughs> maybe states away, for some reason, I don't know what it is. They want to keep the secrets to themselves. Well, you know what, guys, for all you out there who are like that, when I find out about them, I'm putting them on YouTube, and I'm going to tell people how to do it the simple way. Um, not to spending hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of dollars and doing all this crap that you don't need to do uh, just to get a simple screen record on here. You know, not record, but a screen mirror, for instance. Couldn't get anybody to tell me how to do it on, on Facebook. YouTube... Like I said, just had a couple of things. One was wireless, and one had all kinds of stupid things that, that you had to buy these uh, 
objects that I have here, which were more expensive and actually had another two, uh, one or two more components that would be very difficult to use out in the field. This is just using your laptop and your controller and those connectors. And you can sit on a tailgate of your truck and do this out there and just get a bigger screen. Say if you got your wife with you or you got people who are actually taking a look of what you are um, recording on your drone. And you all know, trying to get somebody to look, you know, two or three people to look in on this screen as you're recording is a pain in the butt. Okay? But if you got something like this, if you got a big well, there goes the table that went down. You got a big display there for everybody who can gather around and see without being in your way and crowding you in on the controller because you know darn well if there are three or four people surrounding you like this, it's going to be hard for you to kind of keep control because you're going to be distracted. So, there you have it. So, I hope this was helpful and I hope a little bit of entertaining and. I'll be doing more things like this as I find out more things for myself since I get very little help. So I have to, I'm kind of mechanically and technically inclined in certain things so I can usually figure things out by myself. And on this particular issue, I did. So I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope it helps you all out. For those of you who are just starting out, subscribe, like my channel. I'll do whatever I can to. Uh, that can help you get you all started from whatever experience I have and from what things I have found out and uh, that'll be it for right now so this is John the Drone Ranger of South Florida signing off